What's up guys? Today we got a really cool video. Today we're going to be showing you the brand new Matco Tools Pneumatic Half Inch Drive Impact, the MT3779. For you guys that's watched my channel for a while, you know I'm a huge fan of this impact here and this is the Matco M2779. Um, it is a half inch drive pneumatic impact and Matco says the new ones are better than the old ones. So in this video, we're gonna take a look at them, we're gonna compare them, and we're gonna go all over the specs, features, and functions. So you guys stick around, because this one is pretty cool. Guys, like I mentioned in the intro, I'm a huge fan of this impact. This is the older model M2779. This is the 2779G because it's green. Um, for you guys that did not know, Matco puts the color at the end of the part number and that distinguishes them. And we'll go over all of the new models and what the colors are with their part numbers. Now this gun has been around since Matco Michael started becoming a Matco dealer. If you guys have not watched the video, go back through the Matco Tools playlist and check this one out. It's a pretty cool story how this impact ended up in my toolbox. And quite frankly, I'm proud that it happened. Um, it's a good impact. I wouldn't trade it for anything. You know, it's, it's held up. It's done everything we've ever asked for it. And quite frankly, it's done some things that we probably should have used a three quarter inch impact with. Um, it's had some use on it, as you guys can see, but she's still hanging in there and works like she always should have. Uh, great impact, but Matco is telling me the new one is even better. So let's take a look at it side by side against the old one. Obviously the handle material is exactly the same. The shape of the handle is all the same. It's kind of a textured composite plastic type material. The length of them are exactly the same. The width of them is exactly the same. Everything is the same except for one noticeable huge difference and that is the weight. The 3779 is significantly lighter than the 2779. There's a huge difference in weight. All the functions and layouts are the same. Um, it's got the button on the back, the turn knob. And to be honest with you guys, I've never, ever, never, ever, never, ever turned this knob before. I've left it wide open. I want all the beans it can do where the Ugga Duggas can do their thing. I've never changed that. So it's the same on the new one. So if you guys are into the variable speed and all of that, it's there. It's got the same push button forward and reverse on the new one as the old one. Everything's the same, like I say, except the weight. So let's take a quick look at the sales sheets and this is what your Matco guy is going to have on his tool truck to show you all the selling points and the features and the functions of these tools. All right, so here's the sales sheet. And as you guys can see at the top, Matco has nicknamed this pneumatic impact the Rex. And they claim it's the new king of torque the Rex delivers an impressive 1,700 foot-pounds of breakaway torque to tackle even the toughest automotive jobs with speed and efficiency. It has a durable heavy-duty anvil, a lightweight 4.6 pound composite body, a variable speed trigger, one hand forward and reverse toggle. Down at the bottom, 
It says power meets precision for ideal user control equipped with a high performance variable speed trigger that is designed to minimize vibration while providing precise operation. With a rapid 7,500 RPM, our air impact wrench is the go-to tool for swift and efficient tire changes. Enjoy ease of maintenance with a large grease fitting to keep your tool in optimal condition, making it ideal for longer life, taking care of a wide range of automotive tasks. Built to last, our high torque air impact wrench features a heavy duty anvil ensuring a longer lifespan and reliable performance. One of the main things on this sales sheet that I want you guys to take a look at is right down here at the bottom corner. Matco offers a two year warranty on this impact wrench. That's pretty impressive. Um, I know you guys have seen the shops where a guy plugs an air hose up in it and water is just blowing out of the exhaust. You know, for them to put a two year warranty on it is pretty impressive. From my understanding, they will replace the impact on the tool truck um, through the two years and that way you get another one right away. So that's pretty good. For Matco to do that. Obviously here we kind of try to take care of our tools because you invest in your tools and you invest in yourself when you do that. So in our shop we have a two-stage air filter and then it's got another water accumulator on down the line. So we try to keep our air as clean as possible. I do keep a bottle of air tool oil in the drawer with my air tools and each one gets a couple of drops before usage and I always wipe them down when I'm done. Spent a lot of money on these tools, so I do want them to last. Even if they have a warranty, I want them to still continue to go, just like this one has with no complaints. Um, I mentioned the colors. I know a lot of guys are super into colors. Uh, the green one, we'll start with it, because it's probably the most popular. The part number on it is a MT3779G for green. The blue, it's an MT3779B for blue. The purple, a lot of you guys have requested purple tools. Might go listen, so here you guys go. Just for you purple fans, the MT3779PP is the purple and the orange. Now this is where it gets confusing. So you guys pay attention. Orange is mt 3779M. Not sure if M is for mango, M is for mandarin, but all I know in the Matco dictionary, M is for orange. So if you're looking for an orange, don't put an O, it's an M. So there is your colors and your part numbers. Um, you know, there's a lot of controversy with air and, and battery impacts, and this is definitely not the video to kind of dive into it, but I'm still a fan of air. If you drop this in a bucket of oil, rear end fluid, um, a transmission fluid, whatever, it's not going to hurt the tool. In fact, it would probably help it. You know, it does make a mess, wipe it off and you're good to go. Where a battery impact, you do have issues there. I like the fact that it's a consistent delivery of power. There's no power curve loss with batteries dying. There's no connection issues. There's no batteries to wiggle and jiggle and fall out. There's no recharge time, you know, and it's a lighter weight tool. I know there's gonna be some guys that argue that battery's better and that may be the case, but I know a lot of tire shops and heavy duty shops that run air simply for the, the convenience. It's, it's, it's always ready, you know. Uh, it's hard to beat air. It's been around for a long time for a reason. Battery technology is a lot better than it's ever been before. Our tools are strong, battery tools are strong. That's up to you. But here we will always have our impacts, our cutoff tools, our drills, our saws, grinders, our hammers. You know, they'll, they'll be here in our shop. They may not be in yours, but they will be with us. But obviously this is a brand new impact and I have not got a chance to put it to use yet because it just came in. Um, Matco did send all of these via Matco Michael for us to show on this video to you guys. We've got all the colors here. Um, I appreciate Matco Michael running them by and that way you guys could see the impacts in person in color. The blue one is going to be mine. I will put it through the test. We will put an air nozzle in this thing and uh, 
we'll see what it'll do compared to the old one. Um, and we'll do a follow-up video. Hopefully, you guys will consider Matco if you're looking at adding a pneumatic air impact to your, you know, your selection of tools that you currently have. Can't speak for this one yet, but I can definitely speak for this one. It has been a very well loved and used tool and it's never let us down. So if Matt Coast says this one's better, I have no doubt to believe them on that. You know, um, they've upgraded everything in the anvil part to make it last a lot longer, to make it more heavy duty. So time will only tell how well it holds up, but I expect it to do perfectly fine. But hopefully you guys learned a little something and you can use this as an educated decision to add a pneumatic impact to your tool offering and consider Matco as well as looking at the other tools that they have. Be sure to check these out on your local Matco truck and that way you can put your hands on these bad boys and feel the difference of them. Like always guys, thanks for watching. Appreciate each and every one of you. Hit that thumbs up because it's absolutely free. It doesn't cost you a dime and it only helps the channel. Merchandise is over here. Cool tools and discount codes is down in the description. Even clicking the link on Amazon for another purchase other than what's listed also helps the channel and that's definitely appreciated. And like always, it doesn't cost you anything to subscribe and that way you can be sure to see the newest, latest, greatest tools here first. You guys have a great week. Hopefully you enjoyed this one. Y'all have a great one. See ya.